Our election is about understanding the importance of this beautiful country of ours in terms of what we stand for around the globe as a democracy. As a democracy. We know there's a duality to the nature of democracy. Yeah. On the one hand, incredible strength when it is intact. What it does for its people to protect and defend their rights, their liberty, and their freedom. Incredibly strong huh? and incredibly fragile. Hey, no kidding. All right, so they took a... <laughs> She ain't got a teleprompter, right? Yeah. That's what she sounds out. That's what she sounds like without a teleprompter. Yeah. So she just rambling. If you really cared about people's freedom, why don't y'all force the, you know, that on people to keep their jobs? Yeah. And if why you, do you force people that to travel? Why you took people's livelihood away if they don't do that? I mean, you, you care about freedom, right? Anyway, she uh, got interviewed with well, this CNN reporter, asked her a question, right? Man, she don't care about no freedom. And uh, they asked her how she's going to pay for her economic stimulus plan. See, this is the thing. You've been in office for three years. If you could do all these things, why don't you just do it now? Why yeah. you got to become president to do it? Yeah. You can do it now. You're the vice president of the United States. You remember what Joe Biden said? Y'all probably forgot this. You didn't forgot it. It just came to me. Because they got, you know, photographic memory, you know? Photographic memory. Remember Joe Biden said, if you elect me, I'm going to cure cancer? Yeah, I remember that. Still waiting on that cure. <laughs> These people will say anything to get elected, but... Yeah. They'll check out, yeah, anything. check out this uh, question from CNN Reporter. President Trump directed some economic policies last week. Yeah. Can you explain how you're going to pay for those? And can you give us a sense of what other policies you want to unveil going forward? Sure. Well, I mean, you just look at it in terms of what we are talking about, for example, around children and the child tax credit and extending the EITC. That is, it's at six thousand dollars for the first year of a child's life. The return on that investment, in terms of what that will do and what it will pay for be tremendous. We've seen it when we did it in the first year of our administration. We reduced, we reduced child poverty by over 50%. So that's a lot of the work. And then what we're doing in terms of the tax credits, we know that there's a great return on that investment. And when we increase home ownership in America, what that means in terms of increasing the tax base, not to mention property tax base, what that does to fund schools, again, return on investment. I think it's a mistake for any person who talks about public policy to not critically evaluate how you measure the return on investment. When you are strengthening neighborhoods, strengthening communities, and in particular the economy of those communities, and investing in a broad-based economy, everybody benefits. You didn't answer the question. Yeah. We're well, talking about the child tax credit. Yeah. Child tax credit. Did I say tax credit? <laughs> <laughs> this woman makes me so pissed off I can't even talk. Yeah. Child tax credit. <laughs> I said, dang. I said, yeah, that's credit. Man. <laughs> Spitting all over me, man. Hey, look here, man. The child tax credit. That, I mean, it's been. That's, uh, that's been did going I say, on for. Did I say tax credit? <laughs> child tax credit. <laughs> hey, man, I'm going to lower my, um, my prescription on them damn shrooms. Hey, you want to start over? I ain't starting shit over. <laughs> what, what, why are you trying to take credit for the child tax credit? Yeah. Why are you trying to take... That's nothing new. It's been going on for um, decades. Yeah, that's... Y'all didn't sign that in the law. <laughs> yeah, the, the, child, the child tax hey, credit is where they take money from rich people and give it to people in poverty to yeah, help them never bring them out of poverty. I never understand why you give poor people tax credits. Y'all don't give rich people tax credits. <laughs> Just because I make more money, I deserve a tax credit? <laughs> I don't understand that logic. You give poor people tax credits, but y'all don't give rich people tax credits. <laughs> I mean, does that make sense? <laughs> and why are you trying to take credit for the child tax credit? Man, I was—I I remember when I was broke, I was getting the child tax credit. Did it help me? Yeah, it helped yeah, a lot. Yeah, but I was still broke. <laughs> <laughs> y'all act like y'all actually helping poor people. Um, what I want to say is, is the inflation, right? That inflation this across America that all families are going through— it doesn't matter if you got the child tax credit. It doesn't, it doesn't matter if you got the earned income credit. That inflation wiped all that out. All that out. Mm -hmm. 
But why are you trying to take credit for the child's tax credit? That's what I don't understand. And why don't we give tax credits to rich people? <laughs> they got the money. Uh, they don't no, need no, no, no credits. No. Man, the taxes I paid here is nuts. <laughs> that is crazy. I'm like at a 40% tax break. <laughs> that don't make no sense why 40% of my money is... is y'all get out. Man, how much do poor people t- pay? They don't put nothing into well, the Well, actually, people, when see... I mean... Let me talk. People who... Uh, like, I don't get the child tax credit. They take it away. I don't even think... I, I, don't, even get get the, I don't even get to claim my home. <laughs> Yeah, you do. Yeah, we are. <laughs> we don't get no tax credit. <laughs> we don't get nothing. All right. Yeah, but I, I found a good, uh, I found a good account, man. Yeah, yeah, well, man. I got a good account. He he, he does work for um yeah, Wall Private Wealth. <laughs> Helped save me a lot of money. That's a damn good white man. <laughs> hey, um, let me tell you something. Let me say something. But why is she taking credit for the child tax credit? Well, she ain't got nothing else to say. Man, you gotta be an absolute moron to vote for this lady. Hey, um, cut the sign off. Look at um, look at his uh, her look husband. at her husband. It, and then, didn't it, did you get the impression that he's working with her in her speeches? He's like reading her lips. He likes. He's almost about to move his lips. Did you notice that? Yeah. What? Well, like, like. Look at Dan Like, like they all look nervous over there as <laughs> she's talking. Look at the Secret Service by now. She got females, too. She probably fell asleep. <laughs> she looked like she's sleeping, standing up. <laughs> yeah, scroll to the part where you see them pop up. Uh-huh. Okay, there you go. Here we go. Look at him. He's like, man, she is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> they look uncomfortable. Yeah, look at her, look at her husband. Actually, Walsh is a way better speaker than her. I, I would say he's more presidential. I mean, his policies suck, don't get me wrong, but I don't know why Kamala's their front runner, why they appointed her to be the Democratic nominee. She is not a good speaker in public. That guy, her vice president, he can talk. He's got a lot of charisma. Yeah. Yeah, but she. <clears throat> and why is she taking credit for the child tax credit? Well, she didn't have an answer for the question how they're going to pay for her economic stimulus plan. So she brought up the child tax credit. That's so great. I still don't understand why, why, you know, me being, I mean, I'm successful, man, but you should help the rich too, you know, because it trickles down to the poor. It's that trickle down economics. (laughs) Get the f off. (laughs) Give me some room, man. Get over. I mean, I, I'm not pissed that I'm not getting tax credits. Don't get me wrong. I know people. Well, you got to help out poor people, Kevin. You got to help. That's how they get votes. They they help poor people. You know what I find? You think they really help, help poor people? Yeah, it helped us when we was poor. Those child tax credits. I needed those man, child tax credits. Geez, man. Man, that, that child tax credit came in handy. Like, <laughs> man, I'm getting a $3,500 tax refund just for these damn kids I got. Take the kids away. I owe money. You know what? Poor people is like a drain on the system. <laughs> you know that? They take all the money. Don't pay nothing in and take yeah. all the money. Yeah. And then you got all these. I, uh, I don't think it's fair because you broke. You get the child tax credit. <laughs> I mean, I got kids, too. I want the child tax credit. <laughs> Why can't I get the child tax credit? They say uh, you. Um, no, I got kids. They're expensive. I mean, if I a poor person gets the child tax credit, I should get the child tax credit. You know what I'm saying? Kevin, I got not, kids too. You're not living in poverty. No, Keith. No, 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 no. No, it's not fair. Everybody should pay the same, 15%. It should be a flat tax. Yeah, it should I get be a flat tax, 10%. Yeah. Then, you know, they always keep saying rich people don't pay their fair share. That is an absolute lie. They pay everything. Man, <laughs> well, every time I file my tax return, man, I'm crying and all the way to the <laughs> mailbox when I write that check. You don't write the check. You pay it electronically. You talk it's metaphorically. It's a figure of speech. I'm, yeah, I'm talking metaphorically. When I... When, it doesn't matter if I'm writing a check, if I'm sending electronically. That's a lot of money. And the government's going to waste it. Yeah. Because. That money could be far better spent in my child's uh, checking account. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Show's over. My kids need that money. Yeah. They take the money from my kids to give to other people's kids. Is that fair? Yeah, it's America. No, it's not. <laughs> you asked, we answered. Woo! Yeah! Well, we just started a brand new giveaway. Brand new giveaway. We give away a Polaris ATV. 
It's a Sportsman 450. It's got a 500cc engine in it. That's all kinds of CCs. That's all kinds of CCs, and it's perfect for working on the farm, doing donuts in the yep. field, or whatever you white people like to do. Just make sure you don't flip that bitch. Every dollar you spend gets you in it to win. And a 69 Charger General Lee, plus $10,000 in cash. Go to FisherHorseTwins.com and get in it today. Yeah! No purchase necessary. Board were prohibited. See official rules for details. Yeah!